Hey guys, welcome to my channel Mom and Me. Today I'll show you how we renovated our kids toy room. This is our first ever DIY makeover project. So do give this video a big thumbs up if you like how we transformed this room. So this is how it looked before sky blue wall color we had three oak finish shelves where we stored all the toys abc foam mats at the bottom and that's pretty much it though there was nothing wrong with this room but i really wanted to decorate this room as i never had a nursery for my kids when they were born and never really actually got a chance to do something special for them uh, so this is i thought my opportunity to do it the entire room makeover is my and my husband's imagination and hard work or should I say my imagination and his hard work but honestly guys this room turned out stunning and you have to watch this video till the end to see the final outcome so let's begin so first things first, we emptied the entire room and started painting it. I wanted white as my base color in the room rather than blue or pink or any gender specific color as this room belongs to two babies, a boy and a girl. So I decided to go with white as my base color and then I'll add some color by decorative items like throwing pillows, a rug or wall art. I'll see how I go and something which can easily be changed in future as kids grow up. I will be very honest, this was our first ever wall painting project in our house and along the process we realized that it's not an easy job. Few mistakes that we did, one being not using a drop sheet on the floor which actually increased our work so much as we had to clean each and every drop of the paint from each and every tile. Phew, that was a lot of work. Anyways, lesson learned now. So once the room was painted and cleaned, the exciting part begins that is placing things into the room. We started unboxing our new pure foam mattress that we were very lucky to get at a huge bargain from Emart. Once it was open, we let it sit for a few hours to settle and all the chemical smell to evaporate before we could do anything further. Just a disclaimer here, this is not a sponsored video. This is everything uh, that you see in the uh, video. We have bought all the products with our money. So it's no sponsored video. The next thing we decided to do is assemble kids study desk. We got this two seater white study desk from eBay and we really really liked it. It has holders on the side of the seat which is so convenient that I can make my one year old boy sit on it without being afraid of him falling down. Stepping out, it's Friday night. We initially placed the study desk next to the wall but we didn't want it kids coloring the white walls with crayons so we ended up moving it next to this window and it's actually much better here as there is so much of light on the side of the room. Now it was time to put all the toys into the same shelves so we placed the oak shelves into our room but honestly it just looked out of the place with the white theme. Not so much actually in this video, but in reality, it just didn't fit. So we decided to paint them white too. And trust me, once they were all painted, they looked so cute that I would go to my kids' room again and again to see them, how perfect they looked. But guess what? I forgot to take a shot of empty shelves in the room and arrange the toys out of excitement. Yes, I'm single, oh, we want to mingle, and my friends are on the way. You got that good, good vibe, I want to spend some And this is how it looks. I think just adding toys added so much color into the room already. Next, I put the bed sheet on the mattress. The idea here is to have an Indian better type of place for my kids to play where they can play and yet it's safe for them and could avoid tripping and falling while I'm away and they are not under my observation. 
I want to buy a nice bed sheet for this room as this blue one is just a workaround for now as I had it in my linen closet so I used it anyway but I'll keep looking for one nice bed sheet for this room. Now to the most exciting part which is throwing the cushions. I love, simply love this teal and this multicolor cushions. They add so much character to this room. These are from Emart too. To me, I'm gonna tell you right now, cause she's the one I'm thinking of. Hey, the only and I bought these two from Kmart, and the previous one from were from Amart, and these two are from Kmart, and are perfect to hide this switchboard. The only one I'm thinking of. Hey, she's everything I'm dreaming. Lastly, we added rugs to the floor to make this area soft and safe while kids are playing. And believe me, kids love this room. They spend so much time here every day and I think all the efforts that we put in this room are completely worth it. So on the right side of the room, I have this multicolored diamond shaped rug uh, which is actually a uh, a bit underneath the mattress as well i wanted a little bit of area here covered by the mattress uh, by the rug so that if my baby falls just in case so he doesn't bump his head on the floor so and it really goes well this rug with the cushions i think they go really well together and then the on the other side of the room we have this beautiful white rug that has printed flowers on it colorful flowers on it that really goes well with the white shelves with the toys and it comes down to this beautiful rug i think um this kind of divides this room into the mattress area or the indian batak area and the toy area so i think it goes really well the one that i can live without mm, that smile makes me tripping out i want to dance with you tonight yeah. you close to me feeling good guys if you're still watching this video i want to tell you that the comment section has been disabled on my video by youtube to take care of uh, minors uh, privacy so if you want to comment anything on this video please go to my community section and i'll upload the same thumb thumbnail uh, as in this video and you can make your comments there and i'll definitely read them and reply to them and i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new here i love you to stick around if you like what you see and bye for now. Good, I